Hi, I am the guy known as Kasai, and welcome back to WWE 2K20, my career mode. Last time, we are on the Young Classic, and uh, now we're a part of NXT. We are NXT. The Crimson King of NXT. The Rose Queen of NXT. The Crimson everything. Everything's just NXT. We're NXT. No. After, after some things, I think. At least we know we're part of NXT now. Oh, oh. loading circle. Uh, I hate these things so much. Then why were you in such a hurry to get here? Because I hate being late slightly more than I hate awkward social obligations. I mean, if one mm -hmm. more person says something dumb like, "Look, it's red." On the red carpet! I'm going to strangle them. Um, red? Well, there goes my opening line. <laughs> she gets a little cranky when she's nervous. Anyway, I've been covering the WWE Hall of Fame for almost 15 years, and I've never seen anything like this. We've had individuals, tag teams, factions, families, but never a pair of best friends inducted together. This yep. is truly a special night. So, um, it really is, Byron. But just because I look at the Miz in the background over, and doesn't mean caught. we can't continue to give back to the business that gave so much to us. In fact, that's why I'd like to officially announce I'm available for commentary and hosting work. So, WWE, if you're looking to freshen things up around here, then you know where to find me. Are you trying to take my job? What? I'd never do that. Don't be so insecure, Byron. Okay. Well, that concludes one of the most interesting red carpet interviews of all time. Live TV, everyone. What was that? You're welcome for taking the heat off of you. And maybe I was auditioning for a gig. You don't want to stay involved in some way? No. When I said I was done, I meant it. Red. Trey. Velveteen. Oh, wow. Congratulations. But just keep in mind. It's one thing to achieve your dreams, but you will never be the dream. I want to be the, the dream. Great to see you too. See? That's why I hate these things. You run into all sorts of people you have history with. That was super awkward. Yeah? Well, at least it didn't end with someone getting knocked out like back in the day. Hey. Hall of Famer, Hall of Famer, Hall of Famer. There's only two WWE games that allow you to end in the Hall of Fame. And of course, that's this one and WWE 2K16. Well, this one is the one. Um, Where are you going? The show hasn't even started yet. I don't have anything to do, so I'm leaving. Seriously? You should stay. You, you never know what could happen, plus it at least gives the impression that you care. I do care. In fact, I care too much, which is why I can't take just sitting around doing nothing while everyone else gets opportunities. We're still relatively new here. I think you just need to give it more time. We've been in NXT for months and I've barely been on TV. And other than you, no one even knows who I am. It's like high school all over again. Right down to having to ask permission to use the bathroom. Who makes you do that? Cassius Ono. <laughs> Wait, is he just messing with me? See? Exactly like high school. Look, bathroom pranks aside, I think you're overreacting. Really? Watch this. Hey, Ricochet. Good luck with your match tonight. Oh, thanks, Troy. He almost got your name right. That's yep. a start. If that doesn't prove my point, I've also asked just about everyone on the roster to be my partner for the Dusty Classic, and they all said no. Or worse, ignored me. Okay, fine. Maybe there's some truth to what you're saying, but I still believe it'll get better. Yeah, do you think do. anyone would catch on if you disguised yourself as a man so you could be my partner? <laughs> as much as I'd love to try to pull that off, I'm focused on beating Rhea Ripley to get a shot at the NXT Women's Championship. Nice. It's gonna be tough since she still hasn't gotten over the fact that I beat her in the Mae Young Classic. But at least you have the Mae Young Classic win. 
It proves you belong here. My problem is everyone thinks I'm just riding your coattails. Well, you know what? From now on, I'm gonna ride my own coattail. How do you plan on doing that? I need to do something big to get people's attention. Something that'll change the narrative. And oh, I need yeah. to do it tonight. I like the fact that you're not just giving up and going home. But keep in mind, I put my reputation on the line by getting you hired here. So anything you do ultimately reflects back on me. I understand. Yep. But you have nothing to worry about. Hey, do you know where I could get some handcuffs on short notice? Oh. And now I'm, now I'm worried. Oh dear. Crimson King's got some ideas. We need some handcuffs. Where are those handcuffs? I don't know. Do you know? At least we're in next day. How? Um. I apologize. Sometimes when I do long recording sessions, I like to have snacks as I uh, continue. It's a bad practice. Shouldn't be done. I should be in between takes, but um. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and will determine the number one contender for the NXT Championship. Before we get to that match, which my friend Red is going to dominate, there's something I need to say. When I was signed to NXT, I was told to make the most of my opportunities. Yes. Well, so far, the only opportunity I've had is to sit in the back every week like some kind of glorified cheerleader, watching everyone else do their thing, while I ask myself over and over again why I'm not out here. Maybe it's because I'm not good enough in the ring. Or I don't have the right look. Or I rub someone the wrong way. Or maybe it's simply because my friend helped me get a job and no one can see me as anything other than a charity case. I could drive myself crazy trying to figure it out. But one thing's for sure. If I never get a chance to show what I'm capable of, how will anyone know if I deserve to be here or not? Luckily, there's a tournament coming up that has put countless NXT superstars on the map. The Dusty Classic. Only problem is, I've tried and tried to find a partner, and so far, all I've gotten is a bunch of no's, blank stares, and who the heck are you? Oh. But there's one person I haven't asked yet. Someone who calls themselves the Dream. But they've never competed in the tournament named after the real Dream, the American Dream, Dusty Rose. Hey, Pop. So I'm not leaving this ring until Velveteen Dream comes out and agrees to be my partner. Oh, wait, are, are those handcuffs? Are you kidding me? Get this idiot out of the ring. No wonder no one wants to be his partner. Uh, this is certainly an unconventional way of doing things. Yeah, boy. Strapping and going. Velveteen Dream. Ba -dum -ba -dum. He called out Velveteen Dream, and thankfully, here he comes. Yeah, hopefully we'll put an end to this mess. The Velveteen Dream. Look at that man. Sparkly sights. Tassels. His own face on his boots. The Dream. He even has his own freeway shades. It's pretty cool. So, are you going to be my partner? Because as you can see, I'm not going anywhere until I get a yes. Oh. What's it going to be, Dream? Are we going to be the Dream and the King? The Dream always keeps a spare handcuff key on his person. You never know when you might need it. Oh, damn. I'm just gonna strap release him. Um. Oh. If you want the dream to be your partner, then you need to prove yourself by beating the dream in a match later tonight. You got the dream's attention. Let's see if you can keep it. Oh. The match 
tonight against the Velveteen Dream. How interesting. <laughs> Moron quote. Damn. Hey, I did the too sweet. That was too sweet. Yeah, let's, uh, let's go. Let's see how my left. Amy Rose. What the heck was all that? Me riding my own coattail. Well, maybe give me a heads up. Oh, you're gonna hijack the show right before my match. You got this. What was that? Oh, some wacky hair physics. Um, I certainly wasn't expecting that. And there were red ones too. You may relate the letter by after sending it up by holding L1 and R. And then direction. We apologize again for the delay and Go, go, go. Boop. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Is a much nicer term than I would have used. You have to wonder if that interruption will throw Rhea Ripley. A bit more aggressive than how she was when the main young classic happened. Oh. Boom. Oh, oh, ah, Nunso. Stringing together some big moves here. She's showing some great effort. We'll see if it lasts. Well, there's a reversal. New stats press. Boom. Well, that's not it. Press the bumper instead of the trigger. I will get used to it. Although the, uh, the, uh, Controls are a lot worse this year. I personally like the old, older controls a lot better. Having the trigger reversal, square button for finishes and stuff is definitely a lot more annoying this year. Wrong. No! Ah. Boom, push away. Boom! Boom! Kick. Uh, oh, oh, there's the gut wrench. And here comes the power bomb. One. Just the one. Just the one. Oh, another gut wrench. And another power bomb. Oh, I've got a bad attitude. Alright, there you go. Yeah, I'm just gonna ignore that. Boom! Boom. Oh, and here comes another one. And another gut wrench. Because that seems to be the only button I found. A uh, douche. Oh, and another gut wrench. Oh man, I should stop pressing the X button. I should try pressing the other buttons. Maybe a bit more around the body. Let's try a hold. There you go. Boom. Stomps. Stomps. Kicks. And the slams. What's this? What's this? Nah. Wrenching on that arm. And another knee stomps. Oh. What a combination there. Oh. oh, she's back in three. Oh. Ran into that one. Oh, picture perfect. And more. Press more mounted punches and a stomp. Oh, oh I don't know what I did. Okay. 
Boom. Oh, boom. What do you want to do? Performing a standing straight to Rhea Ripley in the ring. And boom. And boom. Uh, boom. Super kick. And a fallback. Yeah. I don't think we have one. Well, obviously, Rhea Ripley and Red both believe they won and deserve the title opportunity. So I guess we'll have to wait and see what happens next. What else could go wrong tonight? Okay, okay. Do -do. Nice stuff. Do 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 do. Oi, oi, oi. Velvetine Dream. Velvetine Dream. B I A L E. Yes. Da 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 da. So next up, the match Velvetine Dream versus the Crimson King. Ross Crimson versus Velvetine Dream. Next on the next T. What? NXT approved? There you go. The custom entrance finally of the Crimson King here. Standing ready. Salute. Release. There you go. Bit of a swipe. Every man's not right. I'm going to have to change that. Um. Yeah, boy, there is only one Ross Crimson, and that is the guy known as the size character for this game. Um, yeah. Completely. Here you go. Fwan. Yeah. And a backflip. Backflips. The Velvet Sing Dream, yeah. Velvet Sing Dream. Velvet Sing Dream. Look at the abs on the Velveteen Dream. The man's physique. He deserves to wear s some stuff like stuff like this. It's, uh, it's weird, but the Velveteen Dream. It's a nice guy. Oh, tell him the camera to follow. This purple mist as well. Purple smoke. Mm. Look at him slowly get into that ring. Yes. And there he is. The Crimson King. Dream, that's the honest. That is correct. Uh, Corey, I think he wants you to go talk to him. 
Velveteen Dream. Velveteen Dream. Boom. Oi. Oh, and a pen cover. One. No. Oh. oh, close line from behind. Oh. And a knee to the face of the dream. Oh, missing a kick. Boom. And a, another few nine punches right there. Boom. Oh. Slap of the hand. And a kick. And a punch. And another one. Uh, oh. Boom. Oh. Ah. Hit him with that neck crank. And a second one. There we go. Slam him back down. It's game over for you, Dream. It is. Oh. Boom. Boom. Whoa. Oh. Where am I going? What the what? I was saying, saying that it was uh, doing something at least. Oh no. No Team Dream popping out of that. Leave me alone. Oh. And now we're going to go for it. And he, uh, reverses anyway. There's punches. Boom! Get in that ring, Velveteen Dream. Boom, Enzo Gar. Enzo Gary. Ah. Uh. Oh. Okay. Boom. Alright. Wait. Boom. Oh, okay. Let's try him. German. Boom. And a pin. One. Nothing. Alright. Come over here. And a leg snap. Boom. Oh. Here we go. Hit you with that elbow. And another one. And another one. Here we've got a springboard and a springboard sent on. Oh, alright. What's this? Schoolboy and a super kick to the dream. Look at him stand all smug. I don't think anyone. I think I've used my finisher like once this entire run, Al. Oh no, another loose dash press. Not many loose dash presses, man. More. Oh, ow. Oh, my face. No, don't drop me. Oof. Ouch. Ouch. Sorry, Velvet Team. Nope, we're going back in ourselves. It is fine. Whoa. Oh, oh, it's what I want. Get up, get up, get up. Get up, get up, get up. And I'm gonna punch you in the face. Oh, wait a minute. Look for a G. Nope. Nope. Twice. Twice on that suplex. And a kick. And a snap. Ah, uh, maybe, maybe. Maybe. Oh, he's going up. Looks like it might. There he goes. In that elbow. Ray, a purple rainmaker. Yeah, that's. Oh. Oh. 
Velveteen Dream is letting Trey win. Oh. You gotta be kidding me. Um. Hey, Joe, uh, the Crimson King versus Crimson. Hooray. Oh, um, well, we're in the classic sort of now. Woo! That's something. That is certainly something. Oh dear. 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 Dear this. Oh, 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 shut up, Google. Leave me alone. You're not wanted at the moment. Do, 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 do. Hmm. Hmm. So, um, let's, uh, I could talk to everyone. Um, well, I'll end the episode off here, and then we'll come back on it on the next episode of WWE 2K20. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.